Ladies, gentlemen, and everyone in between, we are back once again. And I'll be honest with you, I'm excited for this one because this is an ab more. Oh God, abnormality. Nope, we're not nope, starting over. No, we're riding no, it out. No, no. God damn it, my speech impediment got me once again. This is why I can't get a decent job in this economy. I'll be honest with you, it's a really hard thing. But so. Good I'm things. playing this time. Yeah, good things are happening, though. Okay, so Rune Viking Warlord is a game from my childhood. Wait, you and mean it's not Rune Viking Warrior? Do we you had this conversation every time we talk about this game? <laughs> anyway, I called it Rune Viking Warrior, and apparently I, I was just a demon for I saying, couldn't find so. the game for five years. Yeah. Next thing you know, yeah, it took that's a not even the name of the fucking game. It took a while. My childhood was vague, and I'll be honest with you, even mysterious to me, I lived it. All right, so I'm gonna check out the controller setup while you uh, the controller config. Yeah, yeah, I got you. But no, I'm actually excited because I'll be honest with you, I have never finished this game, but I remember loving this game as a child, and I actually played the disc so much uh, that it started having issues because this is actually a blueback CD on the PS2, so it is very easy to scratch and ruin this entirely. And that's exactly what happened to my copy of the game. I literally got it scratched with a small, tiny scratch, and it fucked up every audio line of the game. So like you'd be going through a cutscene and be like the days old and then like the cutscene would be over and like, wait, I got like one sentence out of that? What the yeah. fuck is even going on in this game right now? So if I remember correctly, this intro Yeah. It's pretty dope. The intro dude, the whole game's dope. I'll be honest with you. Like this to me is the definition of like simple mechanics that bring complex setups, in my opinion. And you know what, Poe? This uh, encompasses the mission statement of the channel. Uh, we have a mission statement? We do. I'm probably saying that wrong using the wrong term, but you know what? We're riding with it. What's the mission statement? Nightcaps and nostalgia. Well, because We have both a nightcap. Well, to be fair, this is not a nightcap because we're going to keep recording after this. We're not going... Like, this is one of the problems I have to name this channel. And I'll nostalgia. Let's go. <laughs> Single player, new game. Woo! Uh... Uh, I will... Oh, dude, I'll be oh, honest. I, I love that they... <laughs> they... They did the Doom. They did That's the Doom. That's funny. Yeah. I'll be honest with you. Uh, I would recommend... Uh, I'm leaning medium. Yeah, I'd recommend medium. I, I remember this game being... I'm no hard warrior. Yeah. This game, like, I remember being rather punishing. Okay. So... Now, is it immediately going to kick into the opening cinematic? Yes, I believe so. All right, are you ready for it? Uh, I'm ready. You, you, you want to take another drink before we go for it? Let's take a little sip. Let's go ahead and clink. Let's go ahead and clink. Make sure the ladies, gentlemen, and those in between at home understand what's really happening here, which is we're getting drunk playing video games, and you have to... Okay, there it is. Let's it. go. Mm. But is it suffering if you ask for more? I would, I would you, love it if it just fucking cut out. It's like, oh, my it, disc won't load. Bro, it might just... Like, this, this disc... I paid $5 for this. This is so unreliable. Oh, here man. we go. Okay, oh. so... Oh my god. The man on the right, our character. The man on the left is, I think, either our father or our battle teacher. I don't remember which one. He has six teeth. Uh, who needs more than that? This is this is the Viking era. I'll be honest with you, I believe this is probably set around, if I had to take a, a, a shot in the dark, probably in the 600s. Somewhere between the 600 and the 1000s, right? Because during the 600s is right before the period you have uh, of Vikings invading England, and the 1000s is when you have the Denmark invading England and being repelled and creating the England that we know uh, today, essentially, and the beginning of the United Kingdom. But maybe I'm getting my history confused, so I'll be honest with you, I'm an American, and as an American, I have a dutiful oh, right oh, oh, to be wrong most of the time. Rune stones. From birth, oh, oh. the children oh, of north hear tales of the end of the world. So, this is the cutscene I was talking about that always used to fuck up with me. Ragnarok. Like, he takes such long pauses, like yeah. the audio track would just skip during these pauses. It's so, like. When wolves will swallow the sun and the moon, uh, when the stars will be and snuffed God. and the earth I, I will tremble, when the gods will face the tribes of giants in a final battle that will rule all the nine worlds. Oh, really? I thought they were talking about uh, Dragon Ball Super. No, but if you want to hear about Dragon Ball Super, I know a great guy. He's a Will Smith, and uh, he's not the most devout of his followers. He entrusts stones inscribed with his personal rune, a 
spark of his power in the human world of Midgar. These rune stones are protected by only the most valiant of human warriors until the day they die and are taken by the Valkyrie. Like, you can kind of hear him talking about himself a little bit. Like, Ragnarok. it was, like, this audio problem, but, like, much worse than my original copy. And I'll be honest with you. Oh, creatures. Only one I thought that this game was just Ragnarok. that bad that it didn't have good quality audio. Evil <laughs> like, straight up. Bro, this so, is like a first year PS2 game. Like, it's, it's, I do not blame you. It's beautiful. Of the earth by Odin himself. Only Ragnarok will set Loki free. Fun fact for you uh, Loki John fucked a wolf, and, and the wolf alike. child that came from that brutal uh, merging is the wolf that's destined to and kill Loki. It is only the power Sweet. on Midgard of Odin and his runestones that holds Ragnarok at bay. Oh, this fucking intro. I forgot. It, bro, like, this is... Yeah, no. Speaking of long-winded... Yeah. Oh, it's still going. Yeah, no, okay. we're, we're still in it. Really gotta fill out that 700 yeah. megabytes. Yeah, Merlin over here is giving us the words right now. And strong beyond his years. That's you. Some of you. Oh, yeah, yeah. Shields in the battles at Hindal and Uthabi and aided in the fortification of this village following the dark tales we have heard from the north. Yeah, like, I think we're in Scandinavia, which would be like, you know, like, uh, Norway, Finland, and Bulgaria. ready to take a place among the warriors of this village. Ragnar, son of Jarl. I was going to say, isn't it like Jarl? So Jarl is a title. And it refers to the leader of a tribe, or like a chief. Right, but wouldn't he still pronounce it Jarl? Right, but that's not his father's name, obviously. Like, this is like, obviously something where it's like, oh, we're gonna throw an announce in Norse mythology, and like, <laughs> that's how we're gonna worry about. Shield Brothers, also, is, uh, it's not Sword Brothers, it's Shield Brothers. And, uh, all Fathers. And take up the glorious duties of the Odin Blade. They really could have paid the voice actors more, I'll be honest with you. That might be the problem. Yes. Bro, I, I am... You are Ragnar, son of Jarl. No, I am Nathan, bored as fuck. So you are you are now Ragnar Jarlson. Alright, we're about to start the game. Ragnar Jarlson. We have many a quest and thing for you to do. So, uh, Wotan killed... See, that's funny, because that's the term that would later be used in England um, for the uh, Wotengamot, which would be uh, the collecting of... Um, they wouldn't call them Jarls during that time period. It'd be like, essentially, kings of the kingdom of England to uh, anoint uh, a king, essentially. Sure. Bro, this, this looks like early Elder Scrolls graphics. The loading screen, dude. You're going to suffer. Oh, dude, I love it. Like, this is this is straight up like, oh, we're playing this on a CD. You could be listening to, like, Blink-182 right now, but instead we put a video game on that same exact disc. Can I play Blink-182 right now? Like, can, can stop, I? Stop, stop. <laughs> get, get the fuck off the computer, okay? <laughs> you are not allowed. Um, I'll be honest with you. Like, Do you get a copyright strike on our second episode? I see the rune on the left-hand side. I have yes. no idea what that means. Well, that one says M. N I. Stop. Stop. Bro, those are just letters. Those aren't fucking runes. Uh, well, if they spell something, it'd be letters. If you can't read it, letters then don't inherently rune. have to spell something. Letters don't inherently have to spell something. No. They are you saying they are, oh, oh, are no. Are you saying it's random? And oh, amalgamation of we we will come back to that. Were we? Because I'll be honest with you, I'm more excited about this. Wait. Okay. So it's analog stick. Okay. Yep. Bro, Bro like, that fucking color saturation. So to, Jesus Christ. To be clear, this is one of the first games I ever owned. Uh, my parents. Ragnar. How are you, boy? Ah, boy. Oh, I forgot it. <laughs> I know you're, in a man now. you're a man now, aren't you? Congratulations, warrior. Alright, I don't want to. Do you believe? Nope, I'm out. <laughs> Bye, bro. So, uh, this is one of the first games I owned on my PlayStation 2. I, after over a year of trying to convince my parents to buy a PlayStation 2, I'm mostly using the fact that it was also a DVD player as a selling point. Dude, mm -hmm. everyone, everyone did. That was the main reason it sold so fucking well. 
I managed to convince them to buy one, and literally, uh, we got three games on the PlayStation 2, which I was baffled on. Like, I was like, oh my god, three games? Like, how will I ever beat them all? Hindsight's 2020. So they bought us v Rune Viking Warlord, which we're playing now. Um, 007 Agent Under Fire, which we'll play in the future. We definitely are playing Oh, yeah. I love 007 games. And, uh, Dark Alliance, Baldur's Gate, which... I've tried to play with you before, Bro, and you you just this. could not, you did not have the patience for that game. But don't worry, I'll rope you into it soon. Well, dude, I'm totally fond to, to bring it back. It's gonna happen. So, uh, let's focus on what we're doing now. You're in the village, baby. What's wrong? Okay. Yeah, you're in the village. You need to get into the training grounds. It's not the wall there. Ragnar, it's fair time the village added your sword to our ranks, friend. Did Ulf? No. I can see you have yet to visit the weapons master. Weapons cool, where's he at, bro? The weapons master being you. Where's it? Where's the wolf? Keep, keep wandering. An He's old done man nothing and a girl just came into the village, and they told us that Conrak's men are burning the grove <gasps> of the shit. gods. Conrak is a betrayer of the gods. We shall punish him. We shall give him the glory eagle. I don't know if you're the Vikings in this, but... I've seen Vikings. It's not great. Not a good time. No, but it's... Sounds sounds like a not good time. Uh, essentially. So I'm pretty sure you need to leave the village, but I mean if you want to talk to you. You have invested me in single combat. Did I? We will cross swords again one they're day. They're saying a history you know, right? Like they're saying that there's a reason why you're being uh, considered for uh basically your Viking? You know? Because oh. you, so you have you have, uh so Oh we have stealth! It, I, actually it's not even stealth, it's just to get through tight areas. Like, there's no stealth system in this game at all. Like, enemies in Sleep Number 2. Uh, oh. Uh, yeah. But yeah, so, I mean, so, you had uh, the word Viking, which is actually a Wait, verb. I came this way, didn't I? No. Yeah, this no, is, this is where I started. Oh, is it That's where the started? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, no, I don't really plan out to play with that, fiddle with that, that, uh, that twig there. Uh, you should probably read the sign on the door. Wait, can I actually read that? No, no, the sign on the wooden door. Oh, I'm sorry, I couldn't see the fucking texture. Wait, why is it also like you can't read it. eight feet tall? Why you ask some goddamn questions? Did okay? a fucking giant put this on the fucking we're, door? We're a young man growing into uh, our body, okay? So we still sort of confirm it. Okay? okay, so I gotta find the weapon master. Oof. Yeah. I feel like I wasn't supposed to be able to fit through there. I, I feel like uh, if you weren't supposed to fit through there, you wouldn't fit through there. Nope. Can't fit through that, there. That's a yeah, I feel like we need to leave the village, because I'm pretty sure... Oh, wait, there's an open door. Oh. Greetings, Ragnar. I hope you feel fit and ready for your final training with Ulf. Yes. Drink mead from my table? Yes. 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 Ah. Wisdom will come with experience. I was, I was waiting for you to get that out. I'm excited, baby. The sleep world is not me. Oh, dude, we gotta get mead for the next couple of weeks. I'll be honest with you. My coworker wants to buy you mead so badly. I want him to buy me mead as well. You know what? Speaking of your coworker, yeah. we can't. No, it's too. Yeah, we gotta. We gotta do this. Too too early, despite the ceremony. But yeah, no, I. Uh, before you can we're gonna, see we are gonna constantly complain about not knowing what's going on long when long. we are bantering and drinking beer. I'll, what's going on? Is I'll, going on. I'll, I'll be honest with you. Like this tutorial slash village section is just like to establish your character sure. and establish a reason why you should give a fuck about anything. So we need to go to the long house. Yes, he's in the, he's in the long house, not a mm. long house. No, I said the long you know, we'll talk about that. Drink meat. So drinks and um uh, foods. Is, what, I need to look the square. Okay. Yeah. Asshole? Yeah. It's not even your house. Strong no. Don't you dare fucking do that when we have meat in my house. So, actually, uh, in order to complement a, a meal well made or a drink well poured, oftentimes, uh, North uh, would, would smash the plate or the glass as a compliment. Saying that, essentially, like, no other drink could be this good. Cool. I'm smashing the glass, so I'll never hold a drink well, we have, we, again. We have better drinks in the fridge, so my glass we're also, is... We're also in the modern era, and it's been more than a millennia since that practice has been actually practiced, so I wouldn't worry too much about it at Champlain. Alright, well, uh, let's... Let's go ahead and save, let's call it here, and then we will jump into whatever the fuck is through this gate with a new drink 
I, I feel like I didn't get to a chance to really explain the difference between Viking and Norse Vikinger. Because I'll be honest with you, Viking is a verb, and then Vikinger is what you actually call the person, which is actually commonly misused. So people are like, oh, he's a Viking. No, he's a Vikinger, okay? Viking is the verb, and then Jorm's Viking. That's actually what we're talking about the word. Have I let it go on long enough? Yes. Do I have yes. enough yes. shit to cut? Yeah, okay, you thank you. you. Alright, thanks.